That was the creepiest fucking intro of all time. Okay, <clears throat> as you can tell by that creepy intro, I'm up to something. Well, as you can tell also by the thumbnail and the title of this video, I probably like, some, like tweeted it somewhere within the week that I got Grayson pretty good. So as you can tell by a lot of things, I'm up to something. <sighs> Grayson's out of the house right now. He went roller skating with a couple friends and I really wanted to go, but I had to make the sacrifice so I could stay behind to set up for this prank that I'm pulling on him. I told him that I wasn't feeling well and that I just wanted to stay home and he called me a little bitch and then left. So, I'm feeling kind of good about getting him now. So tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock in the morning, Grayson, <laughs> why'd I just say that like that? So tomorrow morning at 8 a.m., Grayson has an allergist appointment. He goes every once in a while and he gets a couple shots, but this time they're doing a checkup to see how the shots have been working or whatever, and you know, it's gonna take a while, is what he kind of told me. So, hmm, Grayson's out of the house for a little while, he finally leaves me the fuck alone to get some free time. What do I do? Prank his ass. As you can tell, Grayson loves his car. We all know that. It's no secret. You know, he matches his car. He actually went out in a full baby blue outfit tonight because he wanted to pull up to the, the roller rink matching his car, I guess. The kids the kids got something wrong with his in his in his brain. He also has another car that he loves a lot, but he kinda, you know, ever since he got this new car, he's been sleeping on it a little bit. And I, I feel bad for the car. And you know why I also feel bad? Because I got him the car. There is no freaking way you did this! <laughs> Wait. And he doesn't appreciate it. He lets it collect dust, he pays it no attention. The only thing is, he neglected it for too long and now it's not really running too well anymore. So you know what I decided? I'll teach him. Wait, am I even recording? I really hope I am, because when I do this thing by myself, like, okay. I get a little nervous and then I mess some things up, but we're recording, okay, we're all good. So yeah, I don't feel half good about Grayson neglecting the gift that I got him. That's just not nice. I actually love the car. I have gum in. I should probably spit it out. I really just, I, I chomp on gum like pretty heavily, so it's not good to film with it in. <sighs> I'll get it later. I made a video about this on our channel a little while ago, but it was me, you know, going out, being the nice brother that I am, getting Grayson a new car, looking all over for it, then taking it to a shop, getting it customized for about six months. I even have his seats customized to have his initials on them, you know? I really went hard with the thing. What the fuck did I just say? I have really bad, like, Attention, attention problems, especially when I film by myself. <sighs> what was I thinking about? When was the last time I ate? So, you know what, Grayson? You never know what you have until it's gone. Isn't that how it goes? Something like that. I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna prank Grayson and trick him into thinking that his car got stolen. He's paying such little attention to it, you know, maybe this will make him realize that whatever is gone, he misses now because it's gone. Because he doesn't have it. How the f what is what is that term? That's like a thing. It's like a it's like a saying. <sighs> but that's not it. So here, here's how I'm gonna do this part. While Grayson's at his appointment at 8 a.m., guess what? I also made an appointment at 8 a.m. But for something a little bit different than an allergist. I have a tow truck coming here at 8 a.m. That's actually gonna be taking Grayson's car to another shop to get completely like fixed and tuned up and in pristine condition. He has no clue about that. I'm also doing that as a kind gesture so that when the prank is over, there's at least something that he will, you know, not be pissed at me about, you know? Cause he's a little, he has anger issues. You know, he's gonna be out pretty late roller skating. I'm gonna wake up before Grayson. No, I'm not. Do I even have to do that? Yeah, I do. And I'm gonna fake sleep. So he leaves the house and doesn't suspect anything. Cause you know, I'm normally sleeping until like, you know, I think like, I'm not even going to say because then I sound fucking lazy. I don't even want to say it. <laughs> and then when he arrives from his appointment, he's going to wake me up to tell me that his car isn't there. Unless he doesn't notice it because he's a fucking ungrateful piece of shit. You know? That's a, that's a, that was a nice gift I got him. I'm not pressed, okay? I'm not pressed. I'm a little fucking pressed, actually. So he's going to wake me up to tell me that his car isn't there. I'm going to wake up like, oh, dude, come on. Let me go back to bed. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. And then like, just really piss him off and act like I'm sleeping. He's probably going to slap me, so that'll be that'll be fun. I'm looking forward to that. Eventually, after he freaks out for long enough and probably calls the cops, what I want to do is project a picture of me with Grayson's projector in his room with the tow truck and the car on it in our driveway like this to let him know that he got pranked. And then he's going to be like, oh, dude, you got me. I'll be like, yeah, it's actually going to like you know a shop to get pimped out right now it's gonna be so sick you know we're, it's gonna we're, we're gonna get turned into a convertible for the summer it's gonna be amazing he's gonna be all happy and then the real prank starts I'm gonna get a call from the tow truck driver and he's gonna say that the axle under the car holding the wheels on the car was rusted out and broken and old and 
it caved in and the car fell off the tow truck. I think I'm gonna have him say that the car is like pretty much totaled, like so it's completely wrecked. So like, there's there's no way that it's gonna be able to be customized now. It's just gonna have to go to the junkyard. Uh, <laughs> and then he's gonna be so fucking heated. I bet he's gonna be like, yo, come on, is this part of the prank? Is this part of the prank? And I'm just like, dude, this is, I promise it's not part of the prank. <laughs> what are we gonna, <laughs> holy shit. Sorry, I'm thinking about this right now. It's gonna be funny. Wow. I have to try not to laugh. This should be a challenge. Okay. I got, I'm gonna have to keep it together, go full actor mode. And then to make it even more believable, I'm gonna ask the tow truck driver if he could text me a photo of what the car looks like just so we know what we're pulling up to. So for this part, I reached out to a professional Photoshop artist named Kellen. His Instagram will be in the description below. And he made a photo. Something went wrong and Grayson's car fell off of the tow truck and flipped on its side. Um, and that's exactly what the tow truck driver will call me and tell me. When we pull up to the location that the tow truck driver told us to meet at, nothing's gonna be there besides a little piece of paper on the ground. I'm gonna tell Grayson to pull over and be like, where's the car, where's everything? And then we're gonna see the note. <laughs> and then on the note, it's gonna say, it's just a prank, bro. And that's when I fucking win. That's when he'll never sleep on the car that I got him ever again. Grayson, you've been kinda ungrateful and uh, I think you deserve this. I'll see you guys in the morning. Hope you're having fun roller skating. I'm up and it's way too early. I'm not sure if Grayson's up yet. It's about 30 minutes before Grayson has to wake up, so I can actually do this part of the prank just from my bed. Thank God. So all I have to do is text the car shop to make sure that the tow truck is on schedule and will be here at 8. And then once I get confirmation, I just fake sleep until Grayson leaves the house. Ugh. I can't wait for that part. I'm kind of afraid of actually falling asleep though and then sleeping through everything and ruining the whole video. Which is actually pretty realistic. And um, yeah, there's actually a pretty high probability that that will happen. I wasn't in my bed. That would have been so bad if he walked in the room. Thank God he didn't. I got your scar. Holy That was close. Okay, Grayson's gone. His appointment starts in about five minutes and the tow truck guy just called me. The real tow truck driver just called me and told me that he's about five minutes away. Perfect fucking timing. So I have Grayson's car in the driveway. I had to wheel it out a little bit. Like I had to push it because it doesn't really start. Oh God. All right, it's ready to be towed. I'm gonna help the guy load it up onto the tow truck. I'll have a hidden camera in my room. I have one in the driveway. I'm gonna have my filmer hide so that Grayson doesn't see anyone. Uh, everything's gonna be hidden, but first let's do this part. Okay, so the tow truck guy said he can't get the tow truck up the driveway because it's too narrow. So I'm gonna have to like, I guess, roll this car all the way down a hill. Hopefully I don't actually wreck it. <laughs> let's put this in neutral and go for it. Oh, I gotta push it first, I should probably do that. Oh god. And that's how it's done. Oh, almost hit my Jeep. That that wouldn't be how it's done. How am I gonna do this? I think the steering was locked because the car's off. Uh, hopefully we don't actually tip right here. Let's get this thing in there. Yeah, I'm thinking when it gets in there, I'm just gonna post up like this. And that'll be the photo I'll show him. So he knows it's just a prank but it won't be over yet. I'm gonna freeze. How could you be neglecting a car like this, man? I really hope this makes you think twice. I think this will be a good opportunity for the photo to show Grayson. I think we got one that's annoying enough. All right, let's just do one more photo, just, just for safety. <laughs> Such an annoying photo, holy <laughs> Bye Grayson's car. Hope you don't accidentally fall off the tow truck and land on the left side, like in the middle of the street or anything like that. That would be really unfortunate. All right, time to go plan this fake phone call. I'm gonna give my friend of a friend a ring and we're gonna go over this right now. So he is going to be the tow truck driver or company worker who's gonna report to me that 
there was an accident. Hello. Yo. Hi. Okay. Uh, we can be we can be real us right now because we're we're just gonna go over it. Okay. Good. <laughs> okay. Um, I sent you the photoshopped image too. Did you get that? Yeah. Basically, we should just get to like you saying that like it's definitely completely total. You, t you had to look under it and the uh, axle was shot. Like it, it penetrated the engine and and just like broke the whole thing. Definitely no. Yeah. And then you have to just tell me to pull up on on like the scene. Just say like I sent you the location. And then if you want to call me like Mr. Dylan or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then I'll say, uh, well then can you, you send me a picture of the damage so I know what I'm going to pull up to? Yeah. And then, uh, you'll be, yeah, I'll have my driver do that and he'll, he'll send that shortly. And then that's when we'll leave and get in the car so that I can show Grayson the photo while he's driving so that he doesn't like, like, analyze it too much. Okay, perfect. Okay. Sounds All right. good. Alright. Talk to you later. Thanks a lot. Right. Bye. Bye. Alright, so the fake phone call is set in place. Uh, now it's time to just wait for Grayson to come home and fake sleep. And also fake, like, I don't know that his car was towed away and that I think it got stolen as well. Right now I'm going to write Grayson a little note that I'm going to give to someone who's going to be filming at the final location. Uh, you'll, know, you'll know what I mean later. Cool. Sweet. All right, it's 9.15. Grayson should probably be home soon. I'm going to set the cameras in place. I'll put one here in the bush in case he ends up parking in that spot there. This is where the Bronco normally goes, so I'm going to place the camera over here. Yeah, blends in pretty well. He's not gonna be focused on that thing. Even if he is, the prank's not over. Ethan! Bro, wake the fuck up. Ethan, how long have you been sleeping? You didn't hear anything before? Because my f***ing car is missing. Check the cameras on your phone right now. The security cameras? Yes, the security cameras. Bro, Ethan, I swear. Bro, why is the camera offline? Are you f***ing serious? The camera's offline, that's fine. Yeah, sure. Someone stole my car. Look, it's not the f*** there, Ethan. Yeah, I'm trying to stay calm. Bro, the, the, guys, what the f*** am I supposed to What, am I, what, am I, what are we supposed to do? The car was locked. There's no shattered glass. The car wasn't locked, Ethan. It wasn't locked because I was getting the f***ing door. So it's, no, it's not my fault. It's the fault that it's this 1969 Bronco. Well, bro, your shit was stolen, bro. What do you even do in this situation? How the fuck did you not wake bro, up? Bro, I don't fucking know. Grayson. This is your fault. Bro, Grayson. It's entirely Grayson, your fault. I got you that fucking car, but it got stolen. You don't think you care? It's entirely your fault, even you were sleeping through it. Bro, you- It's obviously loud! If you want to fucking bring into a car and roll it the fuck out! You didn't see anyone, like, driving- No, I didn't see anyone you driving. Up, I just okay. drove up here. Just calm down for a second. Calm down for a second. <laughs> I mean, we have to call the cops to report it stolen, and now the camera's offline, so there's nothing we can fing do about it. Bro, yeah, there's yeah, always see the person thing. who stole it. We have like, insurance and stuff, I'm pretty sure. Holy sh no sh we have insurance, but bro, what the f? That's a one of a kind car. That's f Don't call the cops yet. What do you mean, don't call the cops yet? Show the cops, the person that stole the f car. But we can't, and you were sleeping? I'm going on the website. And you had someone disable the cameras? I what are you talking about? I'm on the website. Bro, you were sleeping through this whole thing. It wasn't, dude. It's your fault. Holy sh**, Ethan, I swear to God. I'm going to the support website. If you were sleeping, I'm going to the car got stolen. Ethan, I'm going to kill bro. you and the car. It's not my fault. It's bro! Not, bro, bro, this is both of our problems. This is both of our problems right now. You think I don't care, bro? It's both of our cars. How far can it roll anyway? They must have put on a trailer. They must have put on a trailer. Which means they had a loud vehicle up here that you could have heard. Bro, you know I'm a heavy sleeper, dude. Like, bro, that's not cool. chill. You, you need to bro, fix I'm that. I was late last night doing bro. It, it, it's not middle school, but I was waking up in school anymore. You need to fix that. You're an adult. You need to be able to wake up in the morning and get done. Let me just work like that. Okay, let me go. What do you mean this is just work let like that? Let me call Set the alarm! Stop sleeping till 11! Let me call customer service for the, for the, uh, the, the alarm. Ah! Oh, let me go, let me go customer service for the security system. Who the f*** does that, bro? Steals a car at 9 in the morning. How is it even possible? The car's turquoise! It stands out! Who steals a turquoise car at 9 in the morning? It's like turquoise, you're right. We could probably find it, bro. We might have to tweet. Yeah, I'm just gonna tweet. Yo, if you see my car in the street, don't fight. Don't, don't, don't punch him in the No, you can't. I don't want to put anyone in danger, you know what I mean? Yeah, you can't do that. Because if I tweet and then they go up to the person, no, I can't do that. I'll take call the cops if they see them. Just say call the cops if you see them. Should we just call the cops right now? Yeah. 
Wait, let me let me call customer support for the for the and get the picture first. You know? okay, what what you say? Say? Listen, I'm, I'm calling the security to... company. Let me see if they have footage. And... I don't want to prematurely call the cops. You guys, wait, wait, dude, the camera's just loaded. Oh shit. What? Oh god. What? Bro, look. Dude, they just. Oh, you mother. <laughs> 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 Oh my oh god. god! Oh my god, bro. Dude, Grayson, this is our guy, dude. That's the perpetrator. Bro, I can't even talk right crying? now. No. I can't even talk right now. Dude, oh my god. Grayson, we got our guy, bro. Oh bro. Grayson, we got our guy. Got him! Oh dude, my you didn't god. See this. Guys, I walked in here and I was trying to stand in front of this and I didn't want you to see this. Bro, get these cameras out of my face. Bro, why am I so weak right now? I'm Holy sh! Because I tricked you into thinking that you got your arms were tingling. I was gonna f punch someone. <sighs> all right, let me let me show you all the cameras, guys. Oh, you think of me? No, let me show you the cameras. That's not chill. It's not even a prank. You, you stole my car. Where, where did you even put it? Uh. Oh, I, I'm sending it to the shop to get fixed. It's getting pimped out, dude. It's gonna be up and running. We're gonna get it, turn it into a convertible for the summer. We're gonna have a nice summer car, right? Bro, is it really or is this part of a prank? You like ruin it? Like pink or something? Um. I think I think the prank's over when you're on the ground and your ass cracks borderline hanging out. I have a fucking stress knot in my back now. No, you need to rub it out. I'm not kidding, my back kinked up from that. Ethan, get get over here, please. E, listen to me. Yeah. Can you please rub my back out? It's on the right side, other side. Yeah, a little bit in more. Oh. I kinked up, bro. That's not chill. Alright, here. Look at this camera. Say hi to this camera, Gray. Oh bro, come on. Dude, that's no. our equipment, bro. Dude. That's our equipment. That's not cool. Bro, but that's not cool. You stole my car. Ethan, you literally stole my car. That's not even a prank. A prank would have been like, oh, if I went outside of the car, it was like upside down or something. Like, that's a funny prank. But you stole my car out of the driveway. The car being upside down and is a prank? Well, yeah, then we just flip it back over. You don't make me think that someone stole it. What if I just called the cops and the cops pulled up? Well, that's, the, that's why I didn't let you call the cops. And I also didn't let you tweet. You freaked out. <laughs> Alright, you can stop cursing too, because we're gonna get demonetized. Yeah, you can't, you can't do that for my prank video, Grace. I've been working too hard on this, Grayson. Frog! Ah! Frog? So you towed my car to the driveway while I was gone, and then you pretended to be asleep. Great f***ing prank. Great prank! Well, normally you're the one waking me up for the pranks, but I guess now you're the one waking me up and getting pranked. I should have known, dude. I should have known because your face was not as puffy as it normally is when I just woke you up. Yeah, bro, it's all in the puff, bro. This is something he would sleep through. I stole every single item out of his room besides his bed once while he was sleeping for a prank. So it's not unlike him. Yeah. Literally, so, like, you could easily do that. I feel like I shouldn't say that on ca- Hello? Yeah. Hi, uh, I'm calling to, to get your information. I have to get uh, some stuff for a report. Uh, you have the 69 Teal Bronco. Yeah. There was an issue on the transport, uh, and we're going to need to grab your insurance information for your regular policy. What do you mean? I got a call from my driver. On the way, there was an issue. Uh, I guess you had a bad axle, um, and during the transport, that axle failed and broke one of the chains on my truck. Okay. And uh, so we're gonna go through your what insurance you unless you wanna, axle? unless you'd like to settle it through. Wait, what do you, wait, sorry, what do you mean, what do you mean a bad axle on the truck? From, so, from what I understand from the driver, uh, it, the, it, it caused the vehicle to, to basically fall off the side of the truck. The vehicle fell off the truck? Yeah. Yeah, it, I mean, it's, it's pretty, Pretty significant damage. Uh, I would say it's most likely total. Usually, when people don't buy their own insurance through us, I'm sorry, when they don't use our insurance, your your insurance, your regular vehicle insurance, the same one you use for your for your vehicle, is what you're using to cover the vehicle during the transport. Yeah, I would assume so. I don't. I don't know if I care anything about that. So, uh, so oh, uh, shit, got insurance. Is, uh, either come over here with the. Dude, there's uh, a one of a kind. I think we had to order all the parts separately. Okay, uh, if you watch- Wait, how bad, how bad, how bad is like the damage? It's, I mean, the, the axle broke, 
and when it came off of the truck, it actually broke one of the rails on our truck. So, I mean, again, that'll be it'll be covered by your insurance. So, I mean, don't worry about that as long as, as long as you have full coverage. I mean, man, I'm not trying to give you a hard time because, like, I know that it's not like that's not you driving or anything like that. But that's like it's like a one of a kind car, and like if it's totaled, like that's it can't just be on us. It's not on us. Right. I. I, I mean, obviously, it's, it's a, like who's to say who? But who's to say the guy was driving safely? You know what I mean? Like yeah, the right exactly, way. Exactly. Like we have we, we have cameras on board the truck. Okay. Well, I'd like to review uh, all of those because. Are you familiar with like with the OBD sensor? I'm not really. I don't really know much about cars. I just like cars, and we were right. Just, so uh, I mean, the, the, the tow truck that was used. Uh, basically, every car after '96 has an OBD sensor. He sent me a picture of it. Uh, I guess you guys want to take a look at the, at the picture. Yeah, yeah. If you could, yeah. Just, if you could just I don't want that. to, but I will. Yeah. All right, uh, we'll just go out. Okay, what, what do you think? Just get insurance stuff sorted out. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. All right, let's yeah. go. Okay. Yo, can you fix it? Alright. It's a crank gone wrong. Drive your car. Or if you have the driver, just uh, send me a photo, that'd be great. Okay, we'll send it over now. Alright. Alright, yo. Eric, he said the other room. Just, just send it and like, send the photo in like, um, five minutes. Ah! Alright, he's... I just sent it. Dude, how the f*** does anyone let this shit happen, bro? You're f***ing... Alright, it's uh, not we're, we're, we're headed to... Saying, you'll probably be able to see from the picture, it's really significant. The car's on its side right now. He's on its uh, side? The, the Let's go! Uh, are, the police, are, are, are the police there yet? Is it break the frame? Yeah, but I don't care if the police are going to be bad, we fix it. The police are... You guys are responsible for getting it towed from there as well. Or if you want, you can you can give us your credit card and we can swipe it through. Dude, I'm really sorry. I agree, and I literally got it towed and they, he was like... It's not chill. Oh, f Dude. This is the most unfucking chill thing that's ever happened. You send me the picture. Don't even show me. You send me the picture. Don't even show me. Holy fuck! This shit is literally on its fucking side, bro. Oh! Bro, I can't drive like this. It's we, on its. Switch. It's on its. I side, can't drive like this. How did it get on its fucking side, dude? Was it even strapped in? No, he literally was. I can literally go back and show you the footage. The car was harnessed wait, like wait, wait. completely onto the. It's that way. It was harnessed completely onto the. You saw it? Yeah. Okay. Bro, I have footage. I literally had the, the pic, Grayson, like the picture. Dude, just because an axle was, what, what, what do you say, failed? No s***. Then don't hook it to a rusty axle if it's a 69 Bronco. You should know how to tow a car if you're a tow truck. It was probably rusty. You just put it on the next one. Like, how hard is it? I could probably strap it in myself. I just go. Why did you let him tow my car? Bro, he was from the company. Yeah, you should have just said, hey, are you sure no, it's he, in? He, he knew what he was doing, obviously. But No, like, obviously he doesn't know what he's doing. If bro, the car's on the side. The car f***ing broke, bro. We've the car didn't break. We should, the, yeah. How does it turn sideways? The guy probably made a f***ing Relax, break. relax. Probably for a drifting the tow truck. Right there, right there. Grace, bro, I don't even want to see this, dude. It's on this road somewhere. Are they blocking the street because of this Wait, pull up. Hey, it's it's my car, guys. Wait, is this where? It's my yeah. Th thank, thank you. you. It's my f***ing car, dude. Are you serious? Just just stop stop by that that pillar. It's not here. Did they take it? I don't see it. Where's the car? It's not here, Ethan. Wait, stop right here. Stop right here. Stop and put your hazards on. Stop up here and put your hazards on. I'm gonna go ask them. Hello. Okay. Hello, Mr. Dillon. Uh, I just got a call from my uh. Greg, my driver gets, I can't it, sounds like, uh, it sounds like the police are going to be picking it up. You said the police are going to be picking it up. Yeah, so you'll have to either uh, grab your registration and insurance and bring it to the impound and pay whatever fee they have. They took it? They, they said they're gonna, it's going to it's impounded by the police. It's, it's, Let's ask these guys. Well, we're from. here and we see a bunch of guys. Uh, I guess they were maybe blocking the street off from when uh, it was towed. Okay. Uh, is there an officer? This but, is ridiculous, uh, bro. Some of these, All like, even, even if they arrive, they may, they may charge you, so um, hopefully the, uh, the tow truck will All right, come thanks, man. Yo, look, in this photo, that's that driveway right there. So the car was literally right here, where those skid marks are. Wait, what's this? Wait, what? It so literally says, two Grayson. Did they leave that for you? No, they didn't. You. What does it say? Just a prank, bro. <laughs> oh my God! It's not a. That's not a construction one. <laughs> oh. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> Holy! Sh I, 
and one. That's the biggest. Bro, what the that f is the f dub I've ever caught in my entire life. Let me see that picture. How did you get that picture? That was right here. Photoshop, baby. Oh my god. <laughs> he was so. Look at this picture. It literally looks like my car's upside down. And this the shattered glass on the <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Great. No! See that hidden camera? We got hidden cameras there. There, there, there. And why do both of our camera guys have vests on? Look at this. Bro, it's construction. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> Are you serious? Here's, here's the thing about Dude, this. Dude, I actually hate you guys, right now. Guys, here at the site, you know, we have the street blocked off. Uh, you know, not for a... Uh, not for your car. Your car is your car is fine. The good thing Where is, is it, though, yeah, actually, it's, it's getting it's actually getting pimped out. It's like actually gonna get. Fixed. And it's not gonna fall off the truck. It's actually there already, so it didn't fall off the truck. I literally said a, I, I, said, I literally said a good prank would be putting your car upside down. You literally did say that. I know. I was like, what? I guess you know. There's a sweet ending, Gray. Your your car is getting fixed. You're getting oh a new God. engine. You're gonna get a convertible. Bro, this was actually this Great. was actually. Bro, you went you went far with this. I did. I did go far. Holy shit. Man. Oh my god. Okay, I'm, now I'm just happy that it's that it's like fake. Are you crying? No, I'm not crying. It sounded like you were crying for a second. Dude, I just like kind of sound like you. Was bro, crying. I've oh, never had that much like I don't know what was inside of me, bro. Holy sh dude. All I was trying to do was just go to the doctors and come home today, bro. How was the allergist? It was good. Are you still allergic to dogs? I'm so allergic. Yeah. All right. Well, I mean, at least you're getting to. Oh my god. <laughs> bro, let's just. You did. You were. Furious. I don't think I've seen you scream that much Holy for that long. And that's saying a lot, guys. Grace Grayson's pretty loud. Well, the good news is your car is actually getting fixed. You're getting a new engine. You know, you're getting a, it's going to be turned into a convertible, speakers, all of it gray. And uh, it's it's not on its side in the road, apparently. I need so. to like, I need to like, <sighs> I need to breathe this thing off, bro. The stress. I think we can, uh, I think we can head back to the couch now. Just please calm down. I'll drive back for you. I know all right, yeah, I can't now. drive right now. No way. I have to get you back. So hard, bro. Yeah, I'm literally no. I'm getting you back. Good so, luck, no, this is this is making me furious, bro. There's fi there's fire inside of me. Let me drive. There's fire inside of me, guys. I am going to prank the actual s out of Ethan, guys. Like you have no idea. You have no idea how good I'm gonna get you. You're never gonna know when. All right. But I'm gonna get you, Ethan. All right. All right. Yeah. <sighs> Holy sh! That was not chill. That was so good. That was way better than I even thought it would be. <coughs> Yo, Bruh. when I was talking to Eric on the phone for a second, dude, like, when my you got on the dropped. phone with Eric, bro, I was freaking out, bro. He was like, "Yeah, the chain step. You're gonna owe me money." I was like, "Dude, f this guy." When when you got on the phone, bro, I've never been more angry in my life. <laughs> <laughs> and then I heard it flipped and I was like, whatever, I give up. I give up on everything. <laughs> I just got pranked pranked and now my car's broken. But in instead I got- You had double pranked. Bro, that's up. You did double prank me. I double bitched you, bro. How does it feel to get double bitched? It feels bad, bro. It feels bad, man. <laughs> wow, okay, oh. wow. Guys, please like this video because I just, I, yeah. I, and for the amount of stress that I endured during this video. Because I, I just give it a like. That was that was that was a pretty crazy one to be honest. That was a pretty good one. That was bad. Subscribe because it would really help me out, you know, uh, with these pranks and stuff. I get real stressed and stuff. So, and if you want to see uh, what prank I'm gonna get Ethan next with, subscribe because I'm getting him good, guys. My guards. I'm not yo. I'm no. Your guard can't. It's be gonna up. be the first prank that you don't succeed. No, with. I already have a few ideas, but I'm going extremely hard for this next one. You're just never gonna know when it's gonna happen. Just don't subscribe. Just don't hurt me. No. That you don't know on anything, bro. There's no rules, bro. There's no rules. You showed me a picture of my car flipped over on its side. Yeah, it was fake. There's no rules. Grayson, you've been sleeping. No. Here. Here's, here's what we need to talk about. I got you that car as a gift, and you've been sleeping on it, bro. You haven't driven it. The reason why it's not driving is because you didn't drive it enough, and the engine started to get shot, and now it just collected a bunch of dust, so it doesn't run anymore. You know, you, know, you don't know what you have until it's gone, right, Gray? Are you going to treat that car with more respect now? Yeah, I am. But dude, it's not that it wasn't treating with respect, it was just not working. Because you didn't. You and I was starting to think about getting it fixed again. Well, now it is. <sighs> wow, I got you good. We should do the weekly shout out. We should. Bro, I'm actual sweating. Like, on my bot, I'm like very much so sweating profusely right now. Just don't touch me or anything. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I gotta change my shirt now, great. This.
video's weekly shout out goes to Krista at Grant Lust. Krista, thank you so much for having our post notifications on and for being subscribed. Guys, if you want to be shouted out in next week's video, turn our post notifications on after you hit subscribe. Unless you are subscribed, then you can just turn our post notifications on. Yeah, why did, so all, little, why did all the salt just go away for you to do that promo right there? Because it, I'm just, um, I don't know. Uh, yeah, if you want to hit the bell and then tweet us a photo that you've done so, we'll shout you out. And also, if you want to see the bloopers to this video, they come out on Friday. Tell them our channel members. Our channel members. Yeah, so if you want to become a channel member, all you got to do is join the little join button on our page next to where it says subscribe. You can just click that, sign up, and you get bloopers weekly. So, uh, we'll see you guys next week on Tuesday. Bro, I'm, sw I'm still sweating. Hopefully it'll be like, you know, a little a more chill video next week for you, you know? <sighs> I'm getting you back, bro. Are you gonna cry? I'm getting you back, bro. No, you're crying. No, I'm getting you back, bro. Alright. Peace. I'm